selfie camera, 4K, 60 FPS. And I have to say, this is the first Motorola flip phone that I have had in my life. Strange because these guys have been doing flip phones for quite some time. So this is selfie. Quality seems alright. I am a cropped in, so it's not the widest field of view. But let's take some selfies now. So I have just switched to 4K 30 FPS, but you can see uh, it is struggling with dynamic range. Uh, and this is stabilization. It is pretty nice day today, I have to say. I need to go to do a little bit of shopping. Uh, so I'll be able to show you like a reward camera test of this Motorola Razer 40 Ultra. It's a bit of a long name, isn't it? Right, so now I'm just using that flip screen. I am in the car. I can just put it up here like that. No tripod, no problem. So that is pretty cool. You know, for content creators, then you should not be disappointed here. And literally just with the tap in the screen, I can just start recording. So I really like that. Let me see. Oh, this is switching to ultra wide angle now. Cool, also when you, Put your hand like this, it will automatically start counting to from three to zero and it will start recording, which is a very useful feature. Sadly, the aspect ratio is uh, slightly different than you would expect on a normal phone, but I quite like this feature. What do you think? By the way, if you are enjoying my content, huge sub to the channel will be very appreciated. We are getting close to 50k subscribers, which is pretty awesome. Now I have switched to stabilization mode. You let me know what you think. I'm just going to a local shop to get some food for my dogs. These are the collars. So far, it's looking good. This is ultra wide angle. And I can even zoom in during recording to times one. Okay, so I'm just using the dual media. Just put a shopping in the car. You can see the car park. So far, I have to say, you know, I'm pretty happy with this film so far, but let's take some pictures now. This is maximum zoom times six. Yeah, 4K 30 FPS quality looks pretty bad. Uh, but let's move back to main sensor. This is HDR 10 plus. Look at the colors. Wow. Just taking the kids for a walk and then I'll be able to have a chance to take some portrait photography. So stay tuned. It is great because the main sensor also works as a macro, so there's an autofocus. So when you're getting close to the subject, look at that, then you can get a nice quality. So let's take some macro shots now.
because this phone can also record um, portrait video mode with our blurry background. So, yeah, in terms of the features, you get quite a lot, to be honest. It reminds me a bit of Motorola Edge 40. It's like a mid-range device. Um, but here you've got those, you know, flip action, if I would say like that. My wife really enjoys using that. Right, I just switched to the night vision video, which I didn't know it was existing. So I am very impressed with that. That's my daughter. Just having the dogs. And we are going for a little walk. But I was not expecting this. This quality looks very nice. Wow. Sadly, selfie camera at night is struggling. Even though I am standing by the light, I'm not sure if you can see much. Uh, but it is struggling. But I'm going to carry on. I know the cat's hiding. Uh, so I might take more pictures. So stick around. found the macro video is doing a great job here it's a snail it is a snail and it's a tiny little snail tiny little snail okay i have switched to the night vision video modes and then um, you should be able to see the difference what do you think i have to say that the phone is struggling with the wind, so I have to go somewhere quieter because the wind is blowing and you will not be able to hear me properly. However, I really enjoy how fast this device is. We've got Snapdragon 8 Gen 1, which is a bit older chipset, but it's still flagship. So I did all editing using this phone on my phone using KineMaster app. Also, I noticed the phone gets really warm when you're using this uh, flip screen which I'm using now so after a little while you can feel it's getting warm and it's you know the phone is very thin as well so other than that I have to say I really enjoy using this phone you let me know your thoughts guys hope you enjoyed this episode and I'll catch you in the next one cheers